Oh yeah. I want to make a blog. I don't want to make a blog just about me and just talk about me because I'm not very interesting to people who don't know me, I guess, I think. I hope I am, but I'm not. Anyway. Um, so I wanted to do something based on a challenge. Me and my mate the other day, we were watching uh, 40 Days of 40 Nights with Josh Hart. He has to go uh, abstinent for 40 Days of 40 Nights. So anyway, I thought, that's not hard. That's easy. I could do that. I could easily do that. So this is what my blog is. I'm going to go 40 Days of 40 Nights without... You know, the old... The old... Easy peasy. Yeah, so basically I'll keep you updated every day, but now I've got to go get in the shower because I've got to get ready for work. See you tomorrow. Alright, well that didn't really go to plan. I got in the shower and I'm sort of bringing up some memories of some, oh man, some good times. I had some good times in that shower. 40 days, 40 nights, start from now. Wish me luck. If Josh Hartnett can do it, I can do it. So, uh, yeah, it's 8.20. I have got to get ready for work. Alright. Okay, just got back from work. Um, no, I didn't do it. Uh, first of all, there were some sticky buns that looked like, just like a pair of boobies. Um, and then I went to the toilet, and Donald had left some pornographic material in there. All over the walls, he'd written it, drawn it, drew a picture of a naked woman. And I know that seems a little bit, you know, but he's good at drawing. It was a work of art. It need, it was... Starting from now, 40 days, 40 nights. Okay, it's 20 past five on the 7th of September. 40 days, 40 nights, now. It's go time. That one at work, that was like my, that was like my secondary Donald's etching. It just, I'll take a photo of it tomorrow. Now, starting from now. Okay. The time is 10 past 10. I've gone at least five hours without. Um, so I'm pretty proud of that so far. Um, only uh, 39 days uh, and 19 hours to go. Here it goes. Night time. What some of us uh, abstinence people see as the hardest time of the night. I think I can do it. I think I can make it through the, through the night. So we'll see. All right. I'll be honest. Minute I turn the camera off. Minute I turn the camera off. The second it went off, basically. So, uh, I've got to take some precautions. <sighs> it's basically the 8th of September now. We'll call that the new start day for the 40 days and 40 nights. All right, wish me luck, here we go. Okay, so last night didn't go so well, but I had I had an epiphany. Um, I realised I've got too many uh, sexy images. Do you like boobs a lot? Yes, I like boobs a lot. Boobs a lot, boobs a lot. Do I like boobs a lot? Really like boobs a lot. Do I like boobs a lot? Today is my forty dot day, and I've had a bad first day. You know, uh, sorry, uh, did NASA land on the moon in one try? No, they had to kill loads of dogs. I'm not killing dogs. We need to assess these things. It's, um, and loads of monkeys as well. I don't even like dogs that much. I'm not that bothered about the dogs, but the monkeys, they're wicked. They're like little people. Okay, it's, uh, 8th September, 2009. Today, I've got to get rid of all of this, all of these sexy images, all of my magazines, all of my DVDs, gotta go. Okay, and this is where it's kept. Uh, I call it the, the spunk trunk or, uh, or uh, the pleasure chest, both plays on the, on the pirate sort of theme. Um, yeah, and so basically inside this box is all of my uh, uh, stuff that I just don't want to get my hands on. And let me tell you something, that there's a layer of wood in that box, so I'm not, I'm not getting in there uh, without losing some blood. <laughs> okay, so um, if we were to rate how successful that was on a scale of 1 to 10, I'd, I'd say about a 1. So 
it's called for this. Uh, it's called for drastic measures. So um, I called in my friend Dan. All right. All right. Just. All right. All yeah. Right. Yeah. And uh, basically, I've got Dan in here because he's going to spend the spend the night with me. And of course, um, I'm not going to masturbate in front of him, and he's not going to masturbate in front of me. So uh, you know, it's just kind of getting over that first hurdle. Then the rest of it, it's just an easy race. So there he is, my desperate measure. I'm standing up, I'm literally like, oh no. Are you, are you, are you masturbating? No, it's, I'm literally leg. Wait, no. All right, yes. What, why, why? I've got forward and you said to keep an eye on you to make sure you didn't do anything. Not, not to, not to, when I just. I'm not the one who's being abstinent. So, so, so? it doesn't make it all right. Just give me five minutes. No, mate! Just no! Get out! Oh, get out! Gotta go to the toilet anyway. Oh, do you have to go to the toilet? Or are you just making up excuses? Don't! Don't take that with you to the toilet! Oh, so you don't need the toilet now? No. Oh, sick, mate! Sick! Last night was, uh, I wouldn't say it was a, a great success on the scale of the whole challenge to date. Um, sharing a bed with uh, Dan. Uh, midway through the night, he sort of found it appropriate to. Uh, All right, mate. All right, morning. Oh. Oh. Cheers, thanks. You all right? Yep. Yep. There it goes, mate. Feel sure it's flammable. Mm. Oh. I can't watch it, man. Shredding's a playboy, surely. All just bits of magazine, mate. I don't. 1994. Hey. Uh-uh. Oh. Just make it harder. I don't want to see it anymore. I'll be in in a minute. It's all right? not how I want to remember no, it's it. All right. Just check the catalog. Alright, so I haven't got long to tell you how all this ends. First of all, Dan, he had to go, that just wasn't working out. He's still a chronic masturbator, but more importantly, he's still my friend. Secondly, I've learned something over the past couple of days. Masturbation isn't evil, it shouldn't be refrained from. It's healthy. It's only when douchebags who do it too much and talk about it all the time turn it into a perversion and, and make it unhealthy. It's like anything, if you do a little bit of it for kicks, it'll only make you stronger. You do it all the time? Your knob will fall off. And thirdly, I didn't mention this sooner, I should have done, but I had a letter from the sperm clinic today. They want me to start donating. So I'm going to start putting my rank into use. <laughs>